Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Sean. <laughs> and I'm going to be checking out the brand new TXT era concept trailer for the name chapter. So let's just jump straight into it. Okay. Ah, it does directly reference the PCR. Okay. Oh my god, this is exactly like magic trailer. But like upgraded. <laughs> What the hell? <laughs> the way that Dungeon's hair is growing out so much already is really funny. <laughs> this is exactly like magic. Do come with me and tell the other boys. Oh dear, I can't. Besides, I can't fly. Peter Pan concept? I'll teach you. Oh, how lovely to fly. I'll teach you how to jump on the wind's back. You might be flying about with me. Saying funny things to the stars. <laughs> Ooh! It looked delightfully easy, and they tried it first from the floor, and then. Oh, there is marionette hints. Literally, okay. From the beds, but they always down instead of up. I say, how do you do it? Wow. Peter did it both slowly and I'm surprised the odd eyes aren't literally the blue and the green. Quickly and immediately he was born across the room. I flew! He screamed while still in midair. And there is almost nothing so delicious as that. Uh, okay, I am so glad this narration is in English so that I can focus on the visuals and not have to try and read captions at the same time. Thank you. And down they went and round and round. Heavenly I can't believe this is literally a magic trailer, but the name chapter version. I'll get to morning. <laughs> that Peter had told Wendy was the way to the Neverland. Wow. Yeah. Peter Pan, Neverland, Wendy. That's the concept. Interesting. Okay. Carrying maps and consulting them at Windy Corners. Could not have cited it with these instructions. Okay, their magic acting has gotten way better. <laughs> Peter, you see, just said anything that came into his head. Close your eyes, Wendy. Leave tomorrow behind. Take my hand and let's go to a place where we will never grow old. Okay, I, I don't know if I remember that thought, but I'll try and save it for later, but... Something just hit me like a truck, and I'll get to it at the end. With no worries. Forever will never end. Ugh. That close-up on Bong you literally just reminded me of the end of Blue Owl. Oh my god. And now you're all covered in feathers, okay. Oh, like a mirror. Okay. Okay. And there are reflections of the mask. And, you know, there's always this kind of, you know, persona and mask things. Oh my god, there are so many details. Oh 
And also Maze in the Mirror, hello. Kai Scene and Frost. So many references. That was a sick transition. Okay, Bolt Arm, I see you. Whoa, my voice. <laughs> Oh, the camera work. Oof. This is amazing. It's not an action movie like Freeze concept trailer was, but it's still very cinematic and beautifully done. Okay, now it's an actual mirror. And now we're in a room. And we're sliding, going up, what? <laughs> oh no, it's the house. It's flying up. Kind of giving me some Wizard of Oz, Wizard of Oz vibes. I mean, where are you planning on going unless you fall, or will they simply fly? <laughs> Don't just ominously look at us and go. <laughs> Thank you. Sheesh. Wow. Wow, they're still not giving us the actual name of the chapter. Oh my god, okay, so straight off the bat, very much like a 2.0 version of Magic Concept Trailer with the projections and them lying on the floor, doing the choreo, the retelling of Peter Pan and the concept being Peter Pan and Neverland. And then you have, they still want to go back to the magic. They still want to stay within the magic. They are really not letting that go. Like, I really thought that with how the Chaos Chapter went and then how Minnesota 2 went, they were going to finally accept that they're no longer going to be a part of the magic. At least in, like, mainstream. I'm not talking about Star Seekers right now, but mainstream, you know, they're growing older. And the whole point of the story is as they grow older, they lose touch of magic more and more. And they have to accept the gray city the gray world that is reality we want to go back to neverland their magic island so they can stay young forever interesting and then it transitioned into this maze in the mirror-esque type of choreo which looked amazing yeah there was like visual references to like like reflections and dealing with you know the dark side of yourself you know the darker one you see in the mirror type of thing and then you had them literally kind of going through the mirror and like bouncing choreo off of each other. And then Bongu. So much of them staying within magic ties very heavily to Bongu, which is interesting because, you know, he's not the youngest, so he doesn't have like that age tie to still being connected to magic the most. But he's such a like huge conduit for staying within magic like if you remember blue hour 
there was a lot of moments, especially at the end, where he wanted to stay in the magic, even so much so that he ended up, like, alone in the magic. And then at the end, we have the house literally flying off into the damn sky. Off to Neverland, off to Magic Island. And then Kai doing another reprise of at the end, not the end, doing another kind of reprise of his eternally scene where he hesitates to follow the members. I don't know why he keeps hesitating. I mean, to be fair, we did see him follow them this time, but there was still obviously that hesitation, so. Wow, but yeah, okay. Peter Pan Neverland, and I swear they have mentioned that before either in a V live, reverse live or something. They have definitely mentioned that before. But interesting, okay, so that is the concept. Peter Pan and Neverland. And yeah, Peter Pan, because he stayed young, he was always able to fly. Interesting, okay. Still major tease that they really did not want to give us the official name, like the sub name of the actual album, so that'll probably come in the next couple of days. Wow. This concept trailer was beautiful. I love how it got shot. Very cinematic, and I mean, I've been noticing that literally since Jin's The Astronaut, and also, as I'm filming this today, um, RM's Wildflower, that whoever the team is that Big Kid have been recently working with have really elevated the cinematic value, and I'm loving it. This trailer was a beautiful. I obviously have to rewatch you catch more things to break things down to theorize all that good stuff but yeah i hope you guys have enjoyed my reaction to txt's the name chapter concept trailer let me know what you thought of this like everything below if you want to drop some of your own theories feel free to do so and if there's anything else you want to comment below go right ahead don't forget to check out my patreon page which is linked on the screen or down below don't forget to subscribe as well as turn the notification bell and send it to you all and i'll see you guys in the next one Annyeong!